what you're doing, no one else is doing it. Yeah. Before you judge a man, walk a mile in his shoes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and then it won't matter anymore because you're a mile away and you've got his shoes. Wearing my white socks in honor of zero. What's up, ladies and gentlemen, monkeys? My name is Sister Cam. Boom, this is Seb Cam. Good morning from my hammock. What a beautiful spot. My favorite little place, thanks to Seoul. And I got my new backpack and this awesome view. Look at me, new shirt, the distressed piece of fruit look. It's just the printer got it a bit wrong. I've changed in printers, don't worry. <laughs> So these prototypes, I'm just kind of working on different shirts. Uh, let's pack up the hammock, go back to Sol's now. And he said he's out all day. What an amazing guy. He's like, I'm out all day. You can use the apartment for laptop, hard drives, all that stuff. So we're going to go do that. The Sol office. And we're out of there. Back to the beach life. <laughs> dun, 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 Mission Impossible keyboard retrieval. I'm headed for the bushes. Well done, Marie, for manifesting this black bag. She just found one unused black trash bag, which is perfect camouflage. You can see there's no way you would possibly see it. And uh, clearly there were some sprinklers or some hose pipes or something. I've gotten it wet, <laughs> but it will be dry inside. Yeah, I got some oats. I forgot about that. I'll be making pancakes. Marie's mindful note in case someone did find it to leave it there, but there's no way anyone would find it unless they were digging up the bushes. One dry keyboard. <laughs> Let's get to work. Just a good old cassette boy. Never meaning no harm. Someday the law might get him. Fighting the system like a two modern day Robin Hood. Cheers, luxury right here. So good to have a blender again. I might make another of these, have two of these. Apple cider vinegar, super good for you and actually gives it quite an enjoyable twist. So that's a whole celery has got in there. Yeah, it's a serial blender, but it does the job. Well, it blends better than my face. I used yeah. to carry a blender with me. Yeah, you're saying you have a little thing you carry. Mm -hmm. 
I learned that people have blenders at their house. <laughs> Okie dokie peeps, welcome to the sink where we're washing the Catadyne B3 bottle. So, inside here, can do with a bit of soap and water now and then. If you've got a brush that will go down there, that would be ideal. This one won't fit down there, but depending where I am, I can usually find one every now and then. It's always good just to wash out the inside and let it dry because it mostly spends 99% of its life wet and damp. I also clean all around here. I've already done that with the soap and inside the cap and outside. That's the cleanest bit and your barrier of protection between the outside world is that. So this is how you wash the inside filter, how you uh, clear it out, you just swish it. Give it a swish, give it a slosh, give it a shake and give it a squish. Now I'm no expert on these filters, but it is my understanding that these little strands start to appear at the end of the filter's life. So it's almost like a warning that hey, your filters are getting old, the white strands are starting to loosen up and come out. When it's brand new, you won't see any of these strands sticking out. And they will filter a thousand liters. So probably in five months, I've probably drank a thousand liters. It's probably about time I get some more. They're roughly $25 each, and you can just screw them into your new bottle. That's the best thing about it. You don't have to buy a new set every time. shoes that are bigger than you really need so you've got more space so these are 11 I doubt you can really read it but they were hurting my toes and then look at my new fancy ones still with the tag on still with the brand new tread David just mentioned I'm size 11 <laughs> so I'm like cool you can have these then they're they've run to Hannah twice I'll leave them there for you sweet you might want to wash them I don't know maybe it's more yeah. authentic before you judge a man, walk a mile in his shoes. shoes. Yeah. <laughs> and then it won't matter anymore because you're a mile away and you've got his shoes. <laughs> Mahalo. Awesome. Mahalo. Thank you, David. I'm glad you, you can make use of those. It's great. Yes. Thank you so much. Aloha. Oh, I dropped that on the floor. Look, aloha. <laughs> what a legend. Oh, right then, peeps. Here's the package from Dustin. There's so much stuff in it, I don't think I can go through it all now. But, stuff like that is really useful because my shoes are wet. So I can put those in, those will be dry. I'll take this with me for sure because I can be repairing my knee. Beep. Looks like full battery. I'm going to plug it in. It's a low level laser light therapy gun thing, like physiotherapists use. I'll be using that. Aha, uh -huh. the beautiful new folding backpack. Awesome. There's the usual big pocket, but then this little front pocket, it goes way deep. That's epic, that's place for a lot more things. Easy access. Toothpaste, I'll figure that out another day. Oh, a new bowl. Yeah, I'll have that now. This bowl is better than my bowl, which is leaking. My old bowl started to leak. I tried to patch it up. But this one, although it's green, it's not quite as cool because it's not black. But hey, at least it hasn't got a hole in it. Oh yeah, fresh waterproof socks. That'll do nicely right now. Because my... Socks are wet. <clears throat> but 
banana energy and say protein one more time. All right, I might do banana energy. <laughs> Get rid of those. Swap them out for these. Boom. New fresh tread lab soles for my cushioning on my feet. Yes. Eat, run, sleep, repeat. <laughs> run, eat, edit, sleep. Run, eat, edit, sleep. Run, eat, edit, sleep. Arm pocket. Comparison. I'll make a proper video of this soon. But here's the old one. <laughs> proper worn out. See how worn this old one is? And look, it was starting to break there. It's getting... It's had about a year of daily use. Completely ripped here. Completely ripped there. I sewed it up once. And the touch screen is getting a bit frazzled. So, let's compare. Look at that. Look at the difference. Before and after. Very cool. Engineer for performance. Memory for moisture wicking. Double zipper. Universal ports, touch screen. It's amazing. I love it. It's my office. I'll do a proper review of this. This is just me kind of swapping gear from old to new, but I'll do a proper review. Purely like a video dedicated to Arm Pocket. Coming soon. Looks a little something like this with a phone inside. Boom. And you can zip it up. You can zip it up if you want, but I never tend to zip it up because I open it thousands of times. These power banks have been powering up. Look at that. What a legend. So I've got full phone battery, full camera battery, like everything's charged. Thank you, Saul. And we're off. This is the beginning of me running around the north part of the island. The island's a bit like a figure of eight. I've done the lower half of the eight. Now we're doing the top half. Woo -hoo! By doing what you love, this. This is just an illusion from the past. I remember this. I remember this in memory. Leave and live in a mystery. And find. We got the people inside the camera, the live stream going on, and a couple of mangoes that fell down in the street. They're just laying on the sidewalk. So I picked them up. And now I'm going to celebrate by eating my mangoes outside the Starbucks. Tiniest mangoes I've probably ever had, ever. Looks pretty yummy to me. Cheers. Pretty amazing, really. Hundreds of these in the tree. 
maybe even thousands. Although now I've got gooey hands. Mango fingers. Amazing. I was so happy I picked those up. Little mini mangoes. Rub it in your hair. <laughs> Banana papaya boats, banana boat. This has been lovely, but it cost me $14 for two papayas and a few bananas and a little bit of celery. It's like, really? All righty then, peeps. I had a little splash around. I had a quick rinse. Now I'm just waiting to dry. I've still got my live people here. What's up people who live inside the camera? Waiting to put my shoes back on once my feet are dry. Could be worse. Big shout out to Cloud Nectar, Tim and Kara, who've done super chat donations I basically I made 20 bucks which has paid for my papaya bananas and possibly my Taco Bell covered by going live it's amazing what an amazing feeling like share your life and you'll be fueled on your way like it's so awesome I love that feeling just show what's going on So, the best thing about Moku Roots right now is I can sit here and power up, and it's a very nice little spot. And it? look at this, woohoo! Very fancy. So, the live people are assuring me it's okay. Enjoy the treat, and hopefully, there's enough calories involved. I got some kind of taco, mushroom taco thing with extra quinoa. Look at that. It's pretty fancy. I'm still going to be hungry. I'm looking at it, I can tell. Like, I know that won't do it. We're still going to have to go Taco Bell, I think. What is that? What is that? What is that? It's a radish. Tastes like a radish. Let's eat the little radish things first. No one really has the, the understanding of like how much calories I need. When I thought we're adding quinoa, I'm thinking it's like, let's have a side dish extra. They just added some in there. Cheers. It does taste pretty incredible. Mushroomy. And carrots, that's what it is. It's mushrooms and carrots with all the extra guacamole and spices. Ooh. So I'm sat here, it's getting dark and I'm just hammering on with the editing because I refuse to give up. She's like, where do you, this beautiful waitress girl, she brought me this. And she's like, where do you charge? And I'm like, right here. <laughs> I just use your power. <laughs> so she brought me this as like a special, special gift. I want to try it. She said it's like a Snickers bar, ice cream Snickers. I'm totally in love with this girl. Whoa, it really is. It's got peanuts in it. Ice cream in it. What? This is amazing. It tastes just like a Snickers ice cream.
If Snickers was an ice cream, it would be this. Wow, it's super peanutty and chocolatey. This is amazing. <laughs> it's so cool. I love your um, energy. He's like super impressed by the running. I'm impressed. I've heard the whole story. Yeah. And I it's really, really well. it's fucking awesome. Yeah. I've never met someone like you. And uh, you've got an iron will. Just keep it up. I'm going to make a small donation. It's just amazing that you even think to do that. That's why I'm like, you know what? Oh, I mean, Come on. Let me a help small, out a that's bit. amazing, man. Let I can't me help believe out a that. Bit. Really? Yeah, of course. Wow. That changes everything. I was scared, like, I need to go to Taco Bell. And then it's like, I don't need to go to Taco Bell. I'm so glad. Like, you don't need to go to Taco Bell and, you know, let me put you up on this on my Instagram story and promote your page a little bit. Amazing. Because you're, you're, what you're doing, no one else is doing it. Yeah. You're fucking putting in the miles. You've got everything right there on your utility belt. You're traveling the world. I mean, this is incredible. My thank hat's you. off to you, man. Oh, thank you. I mean, it's so much more than just the story of a guy running along when we meet people like you as well, because then it reinstills people's confidence in humanity and charity. And it's very valuable what I'm trying to share too with the health information. Like, I haven't been sick, like no cold or flu or headache or nothing, since 2006, 2007, when I made this switch. So this really began with like trying to share with everyone, hey, you could not be sick, but no one really cared, no one really listened. So I was like, hmm, back to the drawing board. How do I get people's attention? <laughs> I was like, maybe they'd listen to me if I don't get sick and I'm running around the world. Yeah. Uh, what a total trip. I'm at a loss for words. No, I mean, I'm, I'm feeling the same right now with you, with you supporting me like that. It's, it's, I never see these things coming, so it's like, I'm just trying to think, how can I save five bucks? You know, I was complaining earlier because I bought two papayas, bananas, and celery, and it was like $14. And I'm like, $14? That's all I've been going on about for hours. And then you come along and completely blow that out of the water, but I couldn't have seen you coming, see what I mean? I couldn't have gone here if it wasn't for the people who recommended go to the vegan place. Don't go Taco Bell and get without cheese again. Like, I've done that so many times. And you know what really gets me excited? Someone like you that's traveling the world, the miles you're running, it honestly makes marathon runners dwarfing their numbers. You're running like 50 miles a day, those are huge numbers. You Not every get. day, but yeah, it's possible. It's just time, really. I worked out, you know, if I put in enough time, like anyone actually could probably do 100 miles in 24 hours, even without much training, like if they just don't give up in 24 hours. But I'm stopping to eat, I'm stopping to, every five miles I'm eating while I'm on the move, I'm like constantly fueling myself. Oh. Yeah. Thank you for chatting. Thanks for taking the time. Oh, no, pleasure. I always love to speak to everybody. Nice. Well, look, I'm going to put you on my story. I'm going to promote your channel, and I'll give you a follow, and let's stay in touch. Yeah, let's keep in touch. It's really great talking to you. You ran across America. You're running across every island in Hawaii, yeah. which we're in Maui, Hawaii right now. And we are in Maui. It's just a total trip, bro. I don't meet interesting people like this all the time. Yeah. So thank you for taking the time chatting with me. Oh, it was a pleasure. I'm super happy I did. I look forward to chatting again. Yeah. Thank you very keep much. Keep in touch. Absolutely. I'll send you all kinds of useful information. Absolutely. Thank you, Jack. You, you made my night. I'm blown away. No, happy I'm, to do I'm it. I'm as speechless as you are now. I'm happy to do it, bro. I'll talk to you soon. Amazing. Time. Thank you. What a legend. I can't believe it. Amazing. I love capturing those moments. I'm glad I put the camera on. This is an adventure. Tonight, take an exclusive behind the scenes look at everyone's favorite TV series. Seb Cow. <laughs>
previously on The Apprentice. Welcome to my boardroom. You've personally seen my bollocks. I don't care which one you want to talk about first. Don't underestimate the pair of them. They were beautiful, really, really nice. I think probably because they were so big. Initially, I thought all my birthdays would come at once. 